Japanese player opinions? Oh man, everyone's so excited about Japanese opinions because they matter so much more. Dude, this is giving me psychic damage just looking at this. We have very different opinions on these fucking matchups, dude. Today I'm going to be looking at Shiki, the Japanese ZSS's matchup chart. For people who don't know, in Japan there's three very good ZSS's. We've got Choko, Shiki, and Kuro. So, one thing I would like to mention before I get into this is that Japan hates CSS. They think she's like top five, top three, top five. And that's a whole lot of horse malarkey if you ask me. So like I said, today we're gonna be looking at his chart. We're gonna see what is up. I First of all, I wanna translate this tweet because this little bit that isn't translated is extremely concerning to me. An S rank character, it seems that it will not be in the top five. Like a real man of the internet, I'm gonna take exactly what that says at face value and say he doesn't think ZSS is top five. So I, I, you know what? I take those. Oh, never mind. He's actually a fucking genius. He gets it. ZSS good? No, sucks. <laughs> we're gonna go from the bottom up. We're gonna see how I feel because I think they overrate the hell out of this character. So we're gonna start. This is this is what I would consider the definitive advantage. Definitely winning. Ooh, Meta Knight as a definitive. I kind of don't like Meta Knight, and I think Meta Knight's kind of good. I, I would argue possibly putting him in the tier above. So it's like not as winning, but it's winning. Definitely right, definitely right. I don't think that is very right. Okay, so this is saying that ZSS beats Mega Man as hard as she beats Zelda. That is not even almost true. That char this character's f***ing good. Agree, 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 agree. Uh, I've never played a Byleth, so probably agree. Jigglypuff, there is a world where Jigglypuff beats CSS, but no one wants to like acknowledge that we live in that world. Just keep that in mind. Hold on, what's that? Oh, you're not subscribed to the channel. Oh, you poor thing. Oh no, sub now, please, please, God. For you, for you. Isabel, I agree, villager. Uh, I agree. Yeah, I'd say I agree overall. I think it's a, a weird matchup. Ridley, agree, game watch. I agree, yeah, sure. I could, uh, that's another one I could see just being up here a little bit. It's not that hard for Game & Watch. Uh, I think this matchup is harder than he's leaning on. Same with this one. He thinks that ZSS just destroys Ness and Lucas. That is crazy to me. This is this is easily like the most controversial part right here. Ike is arguably all the way up here in the losing. This is a hot take right here. This Ike being all the way down here. What the hell? And then, okay, from here, Kazuya. I agree with this. I think, I think she beats all the cringe Shoto fighting game characters. Plant. I don't agree. I think she destroys Plant, straight up. He had he had one pretty close game, or set, against Diz, the Florida Plant player. And it just can turn his world upside down, I guess. Hero, um, he's got a lot more experience versus Hero, obviously. I don't, in, in my head, ZSS destroys Hero. Hey, maybe my mind will change. Uh, this being, I think this character is actually hot, steamy buns. I would move Marth to him losing harder. Wario I agree with. Snake I don't. I think, man, I, I get shit for this every time I say it from literally everyone who doesn't know what they're talking about, which is everyone except for me. Uh, I think Snake is even. It's a hot spicy take I know, but you guys should see my Snake versus any ZSS in the world. Bowser I agree. You know, the weight difference makes that this matchup a little closer than it should be. Uh, Cloud, I don't know if ZSS beats Cloud. That's ambitious. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that's true. I think that might be even this matchup. Uh, I agree with Peach and Daisy and Mario. Mario is another one of those really weird matchups where it can just happen. You could probably say even, you could probably say slight advantage, but I would agree with slight advantage. Uh, you know why I would agree with slight advantage? If you guys run over to pgstats.com and you say, whoa, whoa, what's going on? I'm A&O versus Mario. <laughs> Actually, definitely a lot. A lot better than it, you know. I've never lost to a Mario in this game. So, all right, let's do this. Pichu saying it's even, I think is not right. I think, I, I know I had that whole little war with Void. He thinks this matchup is even, or ZSS winning. And I think it's definitely Pichu winning. And uh, the argument is like, okay, so whoever gets the lead camps, just camps and plays like a goddamn coward until they win. And that's just, the, the first doc basically decides the rest of the game. And his small size is extremely hard to hit. Even if he's extremely light, like me too, dude. You know, Bayonetta, I agree, is even. That's been a hot take for a while. I have basically never played a mid-min, so dude, sure, I think it's even. 
Uh, I think he says beats Lucina. I don't think it's even. He did. Oh, now, now this is a bad take. Not even a hot one. This is losing. Pokemon Trainer is 100% losing. This is an interesting take with Corrin being even. I don't know what Corrins have been hurting Shiki. Terry, I think ZSS beats these two characters again. I think she just does really well against the fighting game characters. Uh, Krom is definitely not even, is definitely losing. I think sometimes that that matchup could be harder than Roy. Wolf, definitely losing, definitely losing, definitely losing. This is the trio to danger over here. Pac-Man, he thinks it's even. It's either even or ZSS wins. That's how I feel about it. I don't think there's a world where Pac-Man beats ZSS. Uh, definitely losing, agree, agree. I think this is even more than I would say. Actually, no, Sheik wins. Uh, definitely losing. Not on the same level as these. She beats harder. Uh, Pikachu definitely losing, definitely losing, and definitely losing. Sephiroth's the hot take here, but I imagine that Sephiroth actually has a pretty good time anti-airing ZSS. Uh, I would also add another tier, because like, some of these some of these matchups are more than losing. Like, like losing badly. I think some of these are fucking hopeful, man. Like, it, I think if you asked Shaki, he would like, if I asked him about like, Pichu, Wolf, Joker Olimar, he would be like, yeah, I think ZSS has to work really hard, but it's even. I'm like, dude, that's just a cover up to say it's a losing matchup, but not as losing. So with that being said, I'm gonna make my own little tier list. I'm mostly just gonna copy his and then I'm gonna adjust how I see fit and talk about it. Is this gonna be troll or legit? It's legit, it's legit. Every character in the game goes into disadvantage, by the way. Thank you for coming. Move ahead. You're right, I will move ahead. Now I'm over here. Wow! All right, so I'm gonna just quickly go through what I agreed with. I think K rule is correct. The Sheik, he he uh, he only has one tier for his disadvantage. I think it's kind of important to differentiate between how hard matchups actually are between like, like a slight disadvantage means like, it's it's definitely winnable. Like if I'm playing someone as good as me and a slight disadvantage, I'm probably gonna lose. <laughs> actually, I'm different. No, I would win. But if they're definitely better than me, it's, it's not a good time. Uh, another one that I disagreed with from Shiki is he thinks Game Watch was like a big advantage. I think it's only a slight advantage. He's got good range, man. He's got better range than CSS with some of his moves. And I think if they just kind of buckle down and stop being stupid with the up E's, they would do a lot better. He put Hero in slight winning. I think it's big dubs. Mega Man, he put it as a big win. I think it's a slight win. Mega Man's good. He's just a very solid character. I don't think Mega Man can lose a matchup like ZSS that hard. I can't think of like a lightweight character that would put away Mega Man. Maybe Pikachu, but he, that character's not fair. Wolf, he put even. What? I want to play the wolves he's playing. If I thought that that matchup was even, I, I want what he's having. I would put it here. I'd put it in like definitely losing. It's not close. Uh, another big one, Sephiroth, he thinks that this is straight up bad for ZSS. However, I have not played that and I have not been scarred by that. Uh, I'll, I'll put it in even for now. I don't think, like, Sephiroth's air to air ability is like on par with ZSS. Uh, Ken is a character he put in even. I think it's a slight advantage. Uh, same for Terry. I just think she can edge guard them and out mobility them and just not get caught up in their bullshit. I think Terry has a better chance than Ken against the SS for, you know, his burst options are like a bit better. Pichu, hot take. He thinks it's even. I think it's slight disadvantage. Slight disadvantage. Uh, Olimar, uh, I think that's a slight disadvantage. I think Olimar does extremely fucking well against CSS, man. But yeah, and fucking Pikmin eat there. What is up with that? It's it's definitely a losing. It's just a matter of how hard. No, I think it's actually that hard. I'm not gonna lie. I think it's bad, bad. DK, he's a trash girl too at heart. I think we'd all agree with that. Ooh, Sonic was another one. Uh, he thinks it's even. I don't have too much experience in the Sonic matchup. However. I ran the numbers in my own head, and I know that's more than enough than a lot of people can say. I think it's a slight advantage. Yink, he thinks it's even. I think it's winning. We have a lot of different opinions. You could tell he thinks Snake is slight winning. I think it's even. I think Snake does way better than people f***ing think he does. Uh, beats this dude. I think this is a slight disadvantage. Uh, he thinks that ZSS straight up wins this matchup, but I don't know, man. I think, like I said, Ike is just better than he thinks. He put Corrin is even. Maybe, dude. Maybe not. I, I just don't see it. I gotta, I have to get emotionally scarred at some point. Figure that out. Shulk, definitely losing. We both agree on that. Shulk's very hard for CSS to fight. PT. P, get me the f out of here. Mies aren't real. Did he put Mies down? He didn't put the Mies down. Let's go. I'm not gonna do it either. Well, I think every time I make it serious, CSS just gets worse in my own head. 
She's garbage, dude. Inkling, I think, is only a slight L, not a big L. <coughs> I don't know if we should have disagreed on any of them anymore. Oh, Mennonite, he thinks that Mennonite gets bodied. I don't think it's that hard. Am I done? Is this the matchup chart? The truth? There you go. This is my matchup chart. DK is nobody's hero. So true, bestie.